Here's a quick fix for um, quite a common problem, especially when it comes to wedding photography, but anytime you are doing a photo shoot with two different cameras, uh, with two different shooters, if the cameras are not perfectly synced with their time, uh, you won't be able to review the photos as they happened. Uh, for example, here we have a scene of a bride uh, drinking from this cup. It was a beautiful Russian Orthodox ceremony here in Vancouver, and uh, the same uh, moment from a different angle happens right here because the two cameras, the primary and the secondary shooter, uh, were not in um, in sync. So one image is here, one image is here, and so all of the images uh, from the wedding are, will be off, but moments like this will be when you're going to notice that the most. So here's an easy fix. Uh, first of all, we need to look at the time when these shots were taken. Now, the time for both of the shots is actually quite off because the cameras were set uh, last year in India and I forgot to reset them to current time. But here we can see this shot was taken 5.58.17 and um, this shot was taken at 5.58.52. So 35 second difference between the two cameras. So how are we going to fix that? Uh, quite easy with Lightroom 3. If you uh, press the backslash, you're going to open up the library filters. We're going to choose uh, the secondary camera, which was the uh, Canon 30D, and select all of the photos from that camera by clicking Command A. Uh, now, very important when you're doing this, when you're doing any changes in metadata, if you do them in a grid view, all of the shots will be changed. If you do them in a loop view, only one of the shots will be changed. So for uh, this um, particular thing, we need to change it for all of the shots. We're going to stay in the grid view. We selected all of the images that were taken on that day by the secondary shooter on a 30D, and we're going to have to change the time on all those shots. We'll do that by going to Metadata, going to Edit Capture Time, and we're going to deduct 35 seconds from all of these shots. Um, you have three different options for Edit Capture Time. We're going to adjust the specified date and time. We're going to adjust only one of the shots by 35 seconds. We're going to move this to 17, so 558, 17, and we're going to hit change all. Even though we did it only in one shot because we're working in the grid view, all of the shots will be changed. So click on change all, and just happens in a matter of seconds. We're going to hide our um, library filters by hitting backslash, uh, remove the filters by hitting uh, command L, so we can see all of the images in the collection. And here we have the image of the bride drinking from the cup and bride drinking from the cup right next to each other. So now, throughout the whole wedding, all of the images uh, will be timed perfectly. I'm going to find another um, example. Here's one with the bride um, kissing the crown from one camera, and that exact same moment is right next to it uh, on the other camera. If you do live in Vancouver, uh, take a look at the uh, my website or my Facebook page for the upcoming workshops on Lightroom. Thank you very much.